Dude, smell my fingers, bro. Whoa. Please. No. Please. No. It smells like lollipops, man. No. Do it. <laughs> Sniff it. I'm not going to bro. Bro, all I did was put tape around my finger, bro. Just yeah. sniff it. Babe, I smelled it. I promise. You smell it first. I he smelled, smelled it already. already. I did it already. <laughs> Bro, it smell like ass, bro. Why? Cause the tape. I don't know, bro. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my bad. Bro, what? I ain't hear it till later. He said he put Look, the tape around. There's nothing on his finger. Snip it. No, nothing. Dude. Nothing on his finger. Nothing Watch on the finger. Watch this. Watch when I put this tape oh around. My God. My Did it smell? What did it smell like? I really almost threw it. <laughs> Lord, but it wasn't, it wasn't like his butt. No, I really almost threw up. That oh, wait, wait. Alright, watch it. No, now that I know it's tape, it's better, but when I hit it fresh and I didn't know what it was. No, listen, listen, bro. It smelled like straight shit. Like, Snip it. I don't care. Snip it. Snip it. it. Bro, no, I did. I know. Wait, Eric. I know. That means you only drop. <laughs> Alright, hold on. Let's try a different one. Come on, bro. I'm not gonna. Whoa! Oh, what are you lift your shit up and you got a boo boo on your hand? So, the clip you just saw was Aries getting everybody to smell his finger. And I didn't know it was duct tape. So, I really was about to throw up. Like, it smelled exactly like a butthole. Everybody else knew it was tape. I didn't. So, those gags right. were. So you still s willingly smelt his finger when you thought it was butt? I mean, because everybody else smelled it. But do you understand? Like everybody else smelled that they knew it was tape, so that's why they didn't like throw up. But I didn't know it was tape, and I'm telling you, you if up. nobody told me, I would have legit thought it was butthole. Like it really smelled like an ass, bro. It was disgusting. Anyways. That's crazy. I was over at DDG's house filming for Dub today and we just got back home. We walked over to our local Chick-fil-A and we're actually sitting here, we already ordered. I guess they have new menu items. Last time I was not impressed. We had rated their maple bacon sandwich and that was honestly disgusting. It was very mid. So I'm hoping today they can set the bar a little higher for us and we're gonna try their new, what was it? Honey pepper pimento. Honey pepper pimento sandwich. And and their banana pudding smoothie. The only thing with today's review, I don't know, if it's amazing, I'm gonna dance, but I'll be honest, guys, it might not sound like it, but I am so mentally drained right now. Like, today was so long, this, this week, last month was so long, and I don't even know how I'm filming right now, to be honest. I hope you guys understand, like, this is vlog number 251. 49 videos from now will be at vlog 300. 65 videos from that will be at vlog 365. Just want you guys to, you know, put yourself in my shoes and really understand, like, I'm grinding every single day, whether I'm sick, tired, mentally exhausted, happy, sad, nervous, anxious, whatever, it doesn't matter, bro. Like, whether I get home at eight o'clock in the morning, four o'clock in the morning, two o'clock in the morning, whether I have to film two days straight for dub and stack four videos before I leave type stuff and, Mentally, am I okay right now? Can I be honest with y'all? No, I'm not okay right now. Like, uh, is it bad to where I like need help? Like, nah, I'm just like not as energized and happy today. It's I'm just, just not like your normal, like silly self. Exactly. I'm just, I, to be honest, I want to break so bad. I just want to go home and relax and chill and just reset, bro, because like today has been the hardest day to keep a smile on my face. And it's even harder when you're around all your friends and they're having fun and you don't want to ruin the vibe. So you just got to paint the smile. I, I don't think anybody could really tell that I was having an off day today. I hope not. I know a couple of people who really know me could like I know Vaughn asked, shout out to him. And I, I know TT was being so sweet, man. She was like, let's knock out a video because I think she could just tell I was just like stressed out. But yeah, am I gonna get up and, and, and do some crazy dance? Maybe if it's that amazing. But if it's not, we're just gonna rate it like normal, regular human beings. So I hope you guys still enjoy the video. I hope you guys still subscribe, like it, watch it, learn from it. 
And uh, yeah, let's rate these menu items one out of 10. Let's figure out, is it fact or cap? Are these hype or are they trash? I gotta give the credit where it's due first before we try these new menu items. And we're gonna give a big shout out to Lexi's cousin because we were scrolling on TikTok and this is how we heard about the items in the first place. So check out this video and shout out to you. I'm trying the new honey pepper pimento cheese. Oh my god, I try to say that. Honey pepper pimento cheese sandwich. <laughs> Spicy chicken sandwich from Chick fil A. I can't wait any longer. I'm just gonna go in. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's messy, but it's so good. So I got the spicy filet. It does have jalapenos on it too. I like it spicy. Best to eat this in your car alone. No one watching. I'm gonna give that an 8.2. I've been most excited for the new banana pudding milkshake. I love banana, especially while pregnant. Oh wow. There's like a crunch in here. Mmm. There's like chunks, pieces, like crunchy. And like a crust. Oh my god, I just looked it up. It's vanilla wafer cookie crumbles. Alright, so we ordered one spicy. What is it called? One spicy what? Honey pepper pimento. Honey Brown. pepper pimento and one regular honey pepper pimento. Let's see what it looks like. This is what the sandwich is looking like right here. What is that? I think it's like coleslaw and sauce or something. That's not coleslaw, man. That is cheese and something. That maybe oh. that's pimento. Oh, maybe it's a sauce with cheese. Look at it right here. Oh, it actually looks that good. That looks really bomb. So Which I'm assuming rich? this is the regular one because this looks like a spicy Wait, it'll one. say it. Spicy. This is spicy? Yeah. Should we do spicy first? I think spicy's gonna hit. I said I wasn't gonna do it, bro. Ten, bro. Really? Ten, bro. Like, maybe my expectations were low because of the last time we came here. I was just in a bad mood. <laughs> I'm in a good mood now. That was so good, bro. It was so good. Right, you have to go for the second bite, dude. How good is that? That is not what I was expecting. That is not what I was expecting. Oh my god. What do you rate it then? 10 out of 10. Bro, that, whatever that pimento stuff is, yeah. it's popping. I wonder what it is. I kind of want to ask. Like, just like cheese and sauce. It's spicy too. I'm pretty antisocial today. I do not want to ask, I'll be honest. But if you want to ask and let me know, that I sounds good. Ask. Go for it, because that was amazing. You could put that in like all my meals for sure. So the question is, is it because it's spicy that it hits? Is there going to be a whole change in the dynamic of the food because it's not spicy anymore? It's just the original? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I mean, I think spice is going to hit more. Wait. I'm not going to lie. What? If I had to explain the rating on the sandwich, it would kind of look like this. Oh. 
it's like um smooth six out of ten without the spiciness really dude i knew the spice isn't that great be bro really it really makes the hugest difference bro watch To me, that was like a four without cool, right? the spicy. How because crazy is that? let me tell you guys, like now it just tastes too sweet. It tastes it like a dessert, way like too sweet. like a honey, like sweet bun. Spicy, the mixture, sweet and oh my god! I can confidently say that you cannot get that sandwich original. You gotta get it spicy. We wanted to eat dinner before we got into our little dessert menu item, which is the banana pudding milkshake. And I just wanted to point out, the spicy one got destroyed, but the regular one had some left, and neither of us wanted to finish it. So when I tell you, when you try this new pimento chicken sandwich, get it spicy. And we do have one last menu item to try. I actually like banana pudding, so the fact that it's as a milkshake, this should be phenomenal. That shake was radical, bro. <laughs> Overall rating of that milkshake there, 10 out of 10. There are like little graham cracker pieces or something in there, like cracker pieces that you can taste. It's vanilla on. wafer. Man, you can feel them crunching while you taste the banana pudding flavor. It is really, really sweet, so it's not something I can have a lot of. So I'm not gonna get hit it with a 10, but it was a good nine out of 10 for sure. So I don't really like banana pudding that much and I don't really like super sweet stuff, so we're gonna see how I like it. I give that like a solid four. Four? Yeah, I don't I really don't like it. Uh, maybe like a three. It's not it's not my my cup of tea. <laughs> what is your overall rating of the new items on the Chick-fil-A menu? My overall rating would have to be six out of ten because the only thing I really really liked was the the spicy honey pepper pimento sandwich. The regular one was super mid. Banana milkshake was not my thing. I didn't really like that. But you guys should definitely try the spicy one. My overall rating starts off with the spicy sandwich. That one was fire. I definitely recommend that you guys try that one because the flavors with that like sweet pimento sauce or whatever it was, the cheese or whatever it was, it made it amazing. Now, the original definitely let me down. It's something I probably would not order again. As far as the smoothie though, for me, that was actually good. Is it a little too sweet? For sure, but is it satisfying? 100% that hit the spot. So overall rating, I'm gonna have to give the new menu items an overall seven out of 10. That is my overall rating. But I appreciate you guys for watching this video. Make sure you go down below, hit the subscribe button, turn on all post notifications. It's time to go.